So on the one hand, you get the win, but on the other hand, you definitely have the team's attention. Well, I would say yes and yes. Yeah. Um, you never, as far as a loss is concerned, you, ne you just never want to have that, of course. You know, people always say you learn from them. Yeah, I'd rather, I'd rather learn from a one-point victory because uh, you will have their attention. Um, and, and they had a chance to experience it, but it came out in a positive way. So uh, we, were, we were able to get the win, and that was the most important thing besides the health of everybody. And so we were able to get away with that. So, you know, we're happy with that, but uh, we want to improve. Yeah. When you look at the number of penalties that occurred, was this the most upset you've ever been after a victory? Uh, yes, and the main reason why I was so upset with it is because they were personal fouls. We had five personal foul penalties, and that is all about self-discipline. And without self-discipline, you're not going to go very far in this game at this level. And um, every day we talk about the team. We're doing this for the team. We represent Alabama and a and University. We never say it's about me. And when you make personal fouls, it's about you. And so that's a mindset, a personal mindset, that we're going to work extremely hard to eliminate. When you take a look at this offense, we talked so much about the, the really experienced guys coming back, but it took a young guy to get that uh, one and game winning touchdown. Can you talk about that play and how it went down? Well, he, he, he's part of the experience now. He was the guy that played last year. He came in as a freshman last year, last year a redshirt freshman, and led the team in receptions. Um, and then we get down there on the um, towards the goal line and uh, called the timeout. We talked about it. And uh, we had a few plays that we were, we were, we were uh, pitching around. Uh, and then we asked him. He said he can beat him one-on-one. -on -one. And I said, so you want the, uh, the, the F option? He said, yeah, coach, give me the F option. We said, all right, let's go with the F option. And, uh, and he went down there and ran a great route. He stuck him like he's supposed to. And the guy jumped on it, came out, and then Deontay threw the perfect ball because the middle linebacker was lingering on the inside. So he had to get up to him quick and low. And uh, he was able to do that. But Monterey ran a great route and made a great catch. Everybody say a great catch for a five-yard touchdown. It was a big play because he had a big linebacker coming right on him. Deontay sat him down so he could minimize the hit. It was a big play for us and ended up being the difference in the ball game. That was a bullet, and he was able to move around and you know not a ton of space, but he had just enough to make a fantastic grab. He did. I mean, he uh, one thing about Monterey is he had great quickness, um, and uh, you know he's one of them cats that's hard to hold in a phone booth, and uh, he was able to make a big play for us and for the team. So. Uh, I was happy for him because it was his first touchdown. Absolutely. Uh, how's everything looking on the injury front right now? Well, you know, the first ball, first couple of ball games, you know, guys are getting hit uh, really hard for the first time, and you know, and then you're trying to play through it with your adrenaline flowing, and then you come down from that, and you're trying to figure out what's hurting, what's not hurting, and so that's kind of where we are now. Uh, we won't really know until tomorrow when we get out there and see how guys are responding. Uh, to injuries, but you know, we were very blessed that we didn't have any major injuries. We got some bumps and bruises, and some, and some nicks are a little more than others, but there was nothing major on our front, so you know, we're blessed to have that. Swag play opens up Saturday against Arkansas Pine Bluff. Uh, what do you know about this team right now? And uh, I guess some of the adjustments you're going to make this week are pretty obvious, but I'll ask anyway. Well, they're very <laughs> similar to us. They want to know, they want a close one. They feel like they should have some improvement or make some improvements. Uh, I'm sure they're pretty miffed about what happened last year. Uh, so they're going to play that as a, uh, a motivational factor. Uh, Monty know me and I know Monty, so uh, we know what uh, each other like to do, so to speak. And so we're going to be trying to counter each other in that regard. Um, uh, we'll start off as a friendly conversation, all that kind of stuff. And then we're going to go after each other. And uh, our teams will go after each other, and we'll see what happens at the end. But I expect them to come out uh, fast, strong. Their offense is uh, very explosive. Um, and um, their defense is going to be uh, up-tempo, trying to get after us and blitzes and things of that sort. So again, I expect another close football game. All right.